Flickr is a photo sharing website that allows you to upload and share your photos with other Flickr users and the general internet population. Because Flickr encourages a discussion and sharing amongst its users, it's fast becoming one of the most popular and widely used social photo sharing websites, making it a great place for you to promote your business. And because of its popularity, photos on Flickr appear very high on Google and Yahoo image search result lists, making it another great way for people to find you on the internet. So let's take a look at how you can upload photos to Flickr. We're logged in here at the moment as Rush Adventure Centre and we're just going to upload some pictures so you can see how simple it is. So click on the Upload Photos and Videos option. This brings you to another step where you can choose the photos and videos you want to upload. So first of all you need to have your photos on your machine. So I'm going to select my photo directory and select the first picture I want to upload. Now if I want to select multiple pictures, simply hold down the shift key and click on the other pictures that you want to upload. Then click on open. Now there are two pictures that I'm going to upload here. But before I upload, first I need to set my privacy settings to be either private or public. Now I want to make the pictures public because I want anybody to see them. So I leave that by default. Then click on the upload button. Now while they are uploading, I'll just explain in terms of the restrictions within Flickr. I have a free account here which allows me to upload 100 megabytes of pictures every month. Now 100 megabytes would generally range from about 100 to 300 pictures depending on the quality of the pictures you've taken. So for example, the two pictures I am uploading here are in total less than one megabyte, which means I would be able to upload approximately another 200 more pictures of a similar quality. And with a free account, you can also upload two videos a month. So there's the two pictures uploaded. Now once I have uploaded them, what I want to do is add a description for each photo. So click on the Add a Description link. You can now see the two pictures I uploaded and the first thing you'll notice is that the title is the same as the file name and is totally meaningless. The title is very important because this is what is indexed within Flickr but it is also indexed within Google which basically means that the words in your title are matched against the search terms used by people in searches. So using the right keywords in your title is essential. So in this instance, I'm going to change the title to Water Skiing in Rush Adventure Centre. The description then is just an expanded version of that title. So here I'll enter Water Skiing in Rush, Ireland. Now I'm just going to copy in a little piece of code that I had here from earlier on. And basically this just puts a link back to my website. So just take a copy of this code and you can use this when you are uploading your own pictures. And all you need to do is replace this bit of text here with your own website address and then replace this other piece of text with whatever you want to appear on the screen. So in this example, I want the words Rush Adventure Center to be a link back to my website. Next, I need to enter some tags for this photo. A tag is basically an easy way of indexing or categorizing content for Flickr. So everybody associates tags with their content. In this example, I'd put a tag in of Rush Adventure Center. But I also want this indexed under Adventure Center. So I put a space for a second tag and then enter Adventure Center. You can have as many tags as you want for each photo, which gives you another way to ensure that people find this content. Click save when you have entered all the details for each photo. You are then returned to your photo stream where you can see the pictures we have just uploaded. And as you can see, the title is displayed here and the description here. And if I click on the picture, I'm taken to a detailed view of the picture where once again I can see the title and the description, which now also includes the link we entered that goes back to my website. This is very handy because if somebody sees a picture they are interested in or an activity they are interested in doing and they want more information, they simply need to click the link back to your website. This is very useful for driving more traffic to your website. So as you can see, uploading pictures to Flickr is quite straightforward. 
The key thing to remember with uploading pictures is that with a free account you have a 100 megabyte limit which will allow you to upload approximately a couple of hundred pictures. If you want to upload more you can opt to go for the pro version which you'll need to pay for. But one key thing to remember is to make sure to include a meaningful title, description and tags with every photo to increase their chances of being found in searches.